Hey YouTubers! Today I am going to do my December favorites video. Let's get started. So the first thing that I've really been loving this month was a gift from a YouTuber. And you guys should all go check out her blog. It's really great. I will put the link in the sidebar. But she was so nice to send me pigments and lip glosses from the MAC holiday sets and I adore them so much. For Christmas sent me this one which is the Cool Capers and I love this pigment set more than anything. These colors are so gorgeous. My favorite is um, Kitchmas which is this pretty light pink. And when you wet this, it's so pretty on the eye. It's gorgeous. And in addition, I love grape. This is, oh, it matches my shirt. <laughs> this is a gorgeous color. So thank you so much for them. I love this pigment set. These colors are so gorgeous. All of them. So yeah. So definitely try to get your hands on them if you can, because maybe they'll be at the outlet stores pretty soon for a discount. So the next is these lip glosses. I love MAC lip glosses, and this was a great set. This L one I didn't think I would like, but I actually love it. It's a really pretty pale pink color. I know it looks white, but it comes off really pale and pinkish, so it's really pretty. But my favorite of the set is, that is Morning Glory, which I do believe is a permanent luster glass from MAC. And it's purpley pink, and it's so pretty. It's what I'm wearing right now. And I really just love it. So keeping on to the lip gloss theme, I have been loving drugstore lipsticks and lip glosses. I think I'm going to do a whole video on drugstore lipsticks. Some of them that I've gotten recently, I got this Revlon Color Stay in Pink Indulgence. And I love this. This is actually supposed to be a dupe for Max Color Crafted. I just love drugstore lipsticks, like more than anything, because they're so accessible and it's peachy scene. And this is from the Maybelline Color Sensational and they always have deals going on and then this which is uh, Rimmel and it's Celeb so yeah I've just been loving the drugstore so different lip glosses so I'm gonna do a different video on those because there's something that everybody can get they're in every drugstore and they're really great quality at a great price. Another thing I've been loving is another lip product <laughs> and it's this lip gloss from uh, Victoria's Secret and it's called Innocent and I bought this because it was supposedly a dupe for NARS Turkish Delight and first of all I love the brush on it because it's kind of slanted and I love doe foots. It's just me. But it's just like really pretty. Um, it's a little bit opaque so you kind of have to rub it in but I love the consistency of it. It's really smooth yet sticky. This MAC blush in Melba. Really pretty. It really is a pinky peach, but you just can't see it true to color. But um, I've just been loving peach on the cheeks. A few more MAC items. I've been loving this MAC Rapid Black um, Pen Ultimate eyeliner and I heard a tip somewhere that you should store it upside down so that all the ink gravitates towards the felt tip so that's a great thing to know. This is really easy to apply and gives you a really sleek dark line. I like it. Um, I've really been loving MAC Fix Plus. I know that's kind of like generic but with the winter being so dry yet cold, it's really great to spray this on either your brush or directly on your face because it just gives you some moisture after you've applied your makeup. Especially if you wear powder foundation like I do with Bare Minerals. Another monthly love is this e.l.f. brow kit. And my friend sent me a bunch of stuff from e.l.f. and I can't wait to review it all for you. 
because this is already one of my favorite things and it's the eyebrow kit and it's a powder this is the powder and this is the gel and as you can see I've already used it quite a lot so it's what I'm wearing on my eyebrows today but I really love it and I love how the packaging is like NARS so I'm definitely going to be reviewing a bunch of e.l.f. products for you another favorite that I've just been reaching for all month is probably Swish eyeshadow from MAC which is this top pink and it's a really pretty pink and if you have brown or hazel eyes this looks gorgeous because it's a pink with sort of a purple iridescence and both purples and pinks work really well with brown eyes now moving on to some non makeup items I have been loving this Moisturel therapeutic lotion from the drugstore it, I found it on the bottom shelf and it's for dry sensitive skin and it's fragrance free and dermatologist recommended and it was actually somewhat expensive it was like twelve dollars but I get really dry skin like on my legs in the winter really love this it is not sticky it has a great consistency it blends in and rubs really nicely I really really love this and after you put it on if you get into your bed you don't have that sticky feeling so another thing I guess these all sort of have to do with the cold weather but I love this La Source by Crabtree and Evelyn. You can get this great kit with it comes um, this is the hand recovery and this is the um, the hand therapy. So they come together. This is the lotion and this is like a scrub. And this is like an exfoliator. Um, you put it on your hands, rub your hands together, and then after like two minutes you just go to the sink and wash it off and then you apply this and seriously your hands have never felt so soft so you can get this at any like Crabtree and Evelyn stores um, a lot of little like boutiques have them but they're a great deal I'm thinking it's twenty dollars and this has lasted me for a full year and I get really dry hands so I love this I hope you can see that now, it's hard to be a health nut and a chocolate nut at the same time, but what helps me out are these Vita Brownies, and I know I've talked about them before, but I seriously eat these every day. <laughs> um, so they're just brownies, and they're only 100 calories, and they're so good. You put them in the microwave for 30 seconds, and they're all heated up and warm. You can eat them at any time of the day. I love these, you know, because it really helps me kick that chocolate craving to the curb. So you can find these in the organic section of, you know, of your grocery store and it's going to be in the freezer section next to probably like the breakfast foods and the desserts. So there you are. Another favorite is the MAC Paint Pot in Rubenesque and I have been using this constantly. I love it. It's so pretty. Um, goes with any skin tone and really just it's pretty alone or just under any eyeshadow, it just has that really pretty like tone to it, like a sheen. And it really doesn't do it justice to look at it on this, you know, YouTube. You have to go see it in person and try it on to really see how beautiful it is. Okay, so now we're a regret or two. One regret I have, and I think it's a regret. I think I need to work with it a little bit more. Because I've heard so much about it, but it is this Rimmel Exaggerate Full Color Lip Liner from the drugstore, and it's in the color um, East End Snob. It's found to be very rough when applying. It's a great color, but it just feels really raw on my lips. So I'm gonna work on it. I'm gonna see if I can, you know, get it to feel a little bit smoother. Maybe it just needs to be broken in, but. Another regret is <laughs> these elastics, these no damage elastics, and they're the ones that are like flat, and they're just so tight. They're so tight. They're too tight. So, and I don't know. I didn't like it too much. So, those are my monthly favorites, along with two little regrets. I hope you know. Please rate, comment, and subscribe, and I'll talk to you soon.